My brothers and sisters, another very powerful point. Do you know that your company affects you? No matter how you look at it, either in a good way or a bad way. It has a positive impact on you or a negative. Make sure you are in the company that is always positive. Look at the verse. Verse number 27 of Surah Al-Furqan. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala speaks about how on the day of judgment, those who had bad company and they, that led them to do bad things, they will regret it in such a way that they will want to eat up their own hands in regret. In the Arabic language, when you say someone is eating their hands in regret, it means it is the height of regret. They regret it so badly. So Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, verse number 27. On that day, the one who has wronged himself will be saying, Oh, I wish that I had not had such and such a person as my friend. وَيَوْمَ يَعَضُّ الظَّالِمُ عَلَى يَدَيْهِ يَقُولُ يَا لَيْتَنِ اتَّخَذْتُ مَعَ الرَّسُولِ سَبِيلًا He will say, I wish that I had chosen the, the path of the messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. I wish that I didn't have such and such a person as my friend. He led me astray. After I had seen the right path, I knew I was treading the right path. After that, he led me astray. Oh Allah, I wish I didn't have him as my friend. Brothers and sisters, save yourselves from now by having friends whom when the time of salah comes, they, they are not, they cannot sit until they fulfill their salah. They are restless until the salah is done. Those are the type of, types of friends you and I need to have. So that on the day of judgment, we can smile and we can go together to Jannah because we've helped each other lead a beautiful life in the obedience of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. This is why we say the importance of your friends.